Here's a few quick notes on selecting a winning entry for your CAD design contest on CAD Crowd. Just an important note, please make sure that the winning design is complete before you select the final winner for your contest. If the design is incomplete, the designer will be paid immediately when you select the winner and we may not be able to recover the funds if you realize after the fact that the design is incomplete. With that being said, it's very simple to select the winning designer for your contest. You can nominate users as your contest is running. So simply to nominate users, you just click the nominate button. Once you've nominated all the designs that you like, you can click the select winners button. Depending on the number of contests you have, you could choose a first through fifth winner for your contest. Since this example only has one winner, I'll just choose the first winner and then click the select winners button and then confirm winners. So that's, that's how you choose the winners for your contest. It's pretty straightforward. You can close out your contest before the end date. Usually that's not recommended because often designers will want to submit an entry before the scheduled time ends, but will hold off right until the end just because they have other projects, other clients, and often day jobs. So if you select a winner before the contest ends, often you'll find that you won't get as many submissions as you would if you held off to the scheduled end time for your contest. Once your contest ends, you'll have seven days to select your favorite designer. Over that period, you can request revisions. Any designers that have submitted designs before your contest ended can continue submitting designs after your contest is, is, is in the judging phase. However, new designers will no longer be able to submit designs for your contest. A few quick tips for choosing the contest winner. When you nominate any specific designer, it gives them points, which counts towards their leaderboard and the reputation on the CAD Crowd community. So if a designer has put in you know, some good effort, even if you're not gonna choose them as the winner of the design contest, we recommend nominating them to give them recognition for their work. So it basically shortlists them gives them points and gives them a badge on their user profile saying that they were nominated for a contest. So it's, it's, it's just something that the designers appreciate even if they aren't selected as the winner. Um, next is requesting all the CAD files and designs um, for your contest. This uh, article highlights what information you may request from the designer in order to close out your project. So please give that a quick read and make sure that the designer has provided all the information you need before selecting them as a finalist for the contest. Finally, this last article runs through um, checking for design originality and has some tips on that.